uh, they're in the they're so they're so senior management. They're trying to get a stand set up, and then they're trying to organise go around, organise the, the gig at the twelve or half twelve. There's your ticket. Best of luck. Thank you very much. We don't need the crate now, do we? We just need to. No. no. We, can we get don't it. need physical. Okay. Anyway, possible. So, we're going to do the 300s, we're doing that. The accountancy pass is on dinner got the times. So, it's going to be a 12 o'clock the accountancy pass to be getting that up. Okay. So, then we'll. And then we're going to be back here about half 12. Half 12. Yeah. Yeah. PG's setting up for quarter past. Okay. Yeah. Truth be told. We'll try again. We'll do another one. Hi, Clutchman. Sorry for the We're different groups. Yeah, yeah. Thanks for letting me say Business Studies is part of the 40th anniversary is run an event, an apprentice event, Students Against Lectures. All proceeds from both, from our side is going to Cope Galway. At 12.30 in the... Half, yeah, half 12 in the canteen we're doing a flash mob to dance into gang gang style. So if you want to see a few lectures, dance them. Uh, try and try. Gang -gang style, <laughs> funny enough. Yeah. Um, we have to raise as much money as we can before half one. Because if we're on the losing team, uh, we'll, we all get fired. Team Yellow are down there. And they're pricing one euro for a date with, with Nicholas, Nicholas Cannon. He's on our team. I don't know who's agreed to this. <laughs> So we need different um, tables. tables. Where could you get tables? Right, so we're just outside Team Carb's room just before their flash mob. Um, they're a bit ill prepared. <laughs> They watched the video for two minutes and now they're hoping to do the flash mob in, in front of the canteen. So best of luck with that, I'll say, and we'll have a look what they do. And take a bath and go Just out of the canteen after Team Carb's flash mob attempt, it was actually brutal. Um, fair play to them for getting up and doing it, like, but it was ill prepared, and you know they just gave up on it after a couple of minutes. Lorna went around bullying people, looking for their the lunch money. I'm not just attacking Lorna here, but they're all at it as well. Nicholas Canny didn't know his left foot from his right foot either, so uh, you know in that kind of sense, it was a poor attempt. Hayley, how do you think that went? Well, I've never been so embarrassed in my entire life, but we raised lots of money, the buckets are shaking, it's a good sign, it's a good sign. Yeah. So. You look like you were robbing people's lunch money there for a second. They look well fed, I don't feel sorry for them whatsoever, no. I don't know how many times Nicholas Kelly has walked past this and not looked at it. Um, He's walked past it and not seen that we're doing a date for Nicholas Kelly. Uh, Nicholas? Nicholas, he just keeps walking past it. I'm going to ask him if he agreed to this date thing, because I don't know, I'm not happy with it. You know where you come down the stairs? Yeah. If we did it there, because then we get them before the we yellows get them. Yeah, it's a great idea. Can we carry some of these tables down? Hi Nicholas, it's Hayley. Hi, um the yellow team has stolen our tables. Do you know where else we could get tables? Uh, the tables, yeah, that we had. Tell Fiona, are you with her? <laughs> and also Nicholas, their prize, did you agree to this? Their prize is a date with you in the GMIT restaurant. Oh, that's not going to go down well. <laughs> Lots of people are going to be disappointed. Okay. Everyone's pulling their weight, everyone's working hard, and totally will prove that the end with the buckets. I'm actually going to I don't know what's going on here, there must be a mix up, but these are ours. You stole our table! No, 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 no,
Yeah, the as new as you lose. We didn't leave the college. Huh? We didn't leave the college. They don't know that I know that they didn't leave the college. I think we should take it's all tactics. Oh yeah, no, there was one we didn't know. We were going down to get the ones we knew first. Oh no, the ones we knew first. To get it in as quick as we got it in. We're going down there. Are you going upstairs then that side? Yeah, we've done the nines. You have to be careful. You cast smooth on the hour. So the Caribs team's table is actually, there's nobody manning it at the moment. Uh, we just had a, a moment ago, the other team, um, there was, uh, they robbed their poster. Sure, there was nobody even at the table, so how were they supposed to keep it? Um, we spoke to Haley there a minute ago and she said the, the rest of the team are off doing tasks, which she didn't uh, disclose to us. There is sabotage going on right now. Well, what happened? Would you tell us? What happened? Yeah. Our poster was stolen. Poster was Okay. Different borrowed and stolen, I don't know though. I don't know what's going on. She won't be smiling in a few minutes when she sees what I have. <laughs> okay, we need to get down here quick and do a drive. Right, okay, ring the other two, bye. Oh, there you are. It's absolute panic stations here with Team Aaron. Team Carb have just landed with a lot of free uh, hunky dories. Uh, they're giving away sweets, selling stuff to students. They've obviously used their 50 euro seat money wisely. I'm not sure what Team Aaron have done with their uh, 50 quid, but uh, they're really panicking here now. They haven't even done their flash mob yet, and they really, really need to play catch up in the next hour and a half, or I think they're going to fall short. <laughs> I think it's all a good idea. We might be a little bit short in the timeline, but we've a good idea. Half 12, 15 minutes last push. Yeah, any last push. Oh, last drive. Oh, oh. um, we've been told that we can go outside. We can. Yeah, they go outside. Well, I've got a test. Right, Joe, uh, obviously I haven't been around Team Aaron, but I'm just wondering how they're getting on. It's a bit of a disaster with Team Aaron at the moment. They've been totally taken aback by uh, what Team Carb are doing in terms of the prizes and the stuff that they're giving away. They haven't even done their flash mob yet, so you know I'm not sure how effective the stuff that uh, Team Carb has been doing, but certainly Team Aaron are in a bit of a spin here. Well, in fairness now to Team Carb, uh, it looks like they're doing great with all the sweets, but they're, they're fairly unorganised. Uh, Lorna Minehan went missing there for about 25 minutes. Nobody had her number even to give her a call. And between that and Nicholas Canny's uh, odd version of the cha-cha slide, you know, they, they're fairly need to pick things up a bit. I can tell you that uh, a date with Nicholas Canny, uh, as I predicted uh, earlier on, has not been the raging success that Richie Hoare thought it would be. So I think that uh, it might be Richie that might have to stump up some of his own cash to go for a date with Nicholas at this rate.
It's make or break time for Team Aaron. They're about to do their flash mob here. They seem to be way behind. Everyone seems to be panicking. They're not showing much initiative or thinking outside the box. So they really, really need this to work well. Otherwise, I think Team Carb will pull away. All right, so we're with Fiona here from the um, Carb team. Uh, Fiona, how's it going for you today? Um, it's going spectacularly well. Um, it's great fun. Um, but everybody's really enthusiastic, very supportive. Um, we, have a, we have great offers, actually. Um, the team is working really, really well together. Uh, everybody's doing something different. Um, the plan is really coming together. I can't believe how much money we've already raised. People are so supportive. Um, it is a pain in the ass asking people for money, but they're very good. And we have great offers, like ice cream, different things. Would you like an ice cream for one euro? Definitely not. Sure? Uh, I'm how is um, Hayley getting on as project manager? Fantastic. Um, she devised a plan of what our target was, first of all with the um, uh, the flash chance in the canteen and then she really went, her gear was upped a little bit in terms of getting the prizes for our spot prizes and um, that's fantastic, that's a great idea. She's given everybody a task to do and she's sticking to it and she's actually following up there, how's everyone getting on, you do this, you go there, she's fantastic. Gangnam Style Gangnam Style Hey we're here with Haley the project manager for Team Carb Hayley, just wondering, uh, it's coming to the end of it now, how do you think today went? We've done really well, I'm really proud of our team, I think they all performed outstanding and I think the results are going to be good. You, you didn't go ahead with the second flash mob? No, the reason was we already done it at 11 o'clock, that went great. Um, the other team had theirs at half 12 and I'm thinking is the same crowd going to be in there from half 12 to 1 o'clock so what we did was we focused on selling the rest of our stuff which we got rid of most of it so and just with that you start selling some stuff to the shops and the yeah. cafe the students union shops took some um, some stuff off of us so that was good yeah. fair play it was your idea was it yeah it was yeah great great yeah, we went up to the, the bar um the hotel and catering the training bar we sold some stuff there people were looking for dessert so we were selling stuff in there all right lovely Thank you.